Lions. That's more like a tree. It looks like y'all bought some folks with you to the fine feathered friends of the girls. Is that right? That's good. There's always room for more here at the Lagoon. For those of you who don't know me, my name's Jasper. I'm ready pleased to meet your acquaintance. We got ourselves all kinds of feathered friends here at the Lagoon. Keeps things interesting, that's for sure. I'm sure y'all be meeting some of my friends here shortly. The fact is, Miss Penelope is usually out strolling around the lagoon about this time. You know about Miss Penelope? Maybe you ain't heard. But Miss Penelope's about the herdiest bird around here. The Lord God gifted that bird with some beautiful tail feathers. Herdiest colors that you ever did see. He didn't waste no pants on her, that's for sure. But the best thing about Miss Penelope is how grateful she is for all the blessings we have here in the lagoon. Why? She'll tell just about anybody who'll listen about the wondrous ways God has blessed us. Hey! Hey y'all, I bet if we give her a holler, she'll mosey on in and say hello. I know she'd be tickled to meet all you new folk. What do you say? Should we give her a holler? Yeah! All right. Y'all remember how? I'm going to count to three, and then y'all yell, Miss Penelope. Okay, I'm going to count now. One, two, three. Miss Penelope! Oh, oh, oh. Oh, my dear Jasper. Well, howdy there, Miss Penelope. I knew if we'd come, if I knew you'd come, if we called you out, we'd come right away. Well, I was just walking around the lagoon. Thanking God for all his beautiful creations. Whatever could be wrong this evening? Oh, ain't nothing wrong, Miss Penelope. I just wanted y'all to meet some new folk. They don't come in with our friends who've been visiting in the lagoon the last few days. Well, it is very nice to meet you. I do hope you're all enjoying the gifts God has seen fit to bestow upon our little lagoon. of gifts from God, weren't that the big, beautiful butterfly the Flamingo Brothers thought they saw? I seen it. Yep, yep, yep. I seen it. We seen the big, beautiful butterfly. Well, twiddly, twiddly, twiddly. If it ain't Fred and Frank, the Flamingo Brothers. Hey, boys, I'd like y'all to meet some new folk. I'm Frank. I'm Fred. We're the Flamingo Brothers. At your service. Did, did you see it? Did you see it? Oh, did you see it? Yeah, I think I did see it, but I can't be certain. I sure saw something. Are you two feathers sure you saw it? Pretty sure. Yeah, we're pretty sure, all right. Remember, God has seen fit to bestow our living with many beautiful creatures, and otherwise, I imagine. I may not know them all, but it makes no difference. They are all evidence of the one who created them. That is God. Jesus right, boys. It's a funny thing how we don't seem to believe what we can't see. Even funnier is how something wonderful can be right in front of us, but we don't see it because we ain't looking. God wants to give us all beautiful gifts. He gets great pleasure out of giving his flock gifts. He sure does, Miss Penelope. Holly sure could tell us a thing or two about that. Where is that silly bird anyway? Hmm, I wonder if he ain't going back to being a little shy. Hey y'all, hey y'all out there. What do you say we try and get Holly to come outside? I'm going to count to three and y'all yell, Hi Holly, can you do that? Here we go. I'm going to count now. One. Hey y'all, 
Hey y'all, this here is my friend Ali. Now, Ali used to be real shy, scared of his own shadow type. Ain't that right, Ali? Fact is, he used to carry a bucket of sand around with him. Whenever he got scared, which was pretty much all the time, he set his bucket down and stuck his head inside it. Ain't that so, Ali? He don't do that no more, though. Ain't got no need to, see? Ali done gone and lost his bucket. He was all shook up until Miss Penelope reminded him that God gave him a special gift. See? God gave Ali the gift of courage. Now he ain't got to be afraid no more. Ain't that right, Ali? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah. It's just like Miss Penelope told us. God takes a mighty great pleasure in giving good things to his flock. And we got a squad of flock here, don't we? Yes, sir. We ain't none of us alike. Even the Flamingo brothers ain't the same. They're brothers. But remember, Jasper, God made us all in his image, and he loves us all in a very special way. You're right, Miss Penelope. Most important is who we choose as our leader. That leader done has to be Jesus, because when we all follow Jesus, we really are God's flock. Isn't that true, flock? Yeah, yeah. indeed. Uh -huh. That's right. That's right. Well, now, how y'all out there? Well, now, here's the best part. We got so many different kinds of feathers and so many different kinds of colors here in this block already. Why not add a few more? If y'all decide you're wanting to follow Jesus from now on, you can be one of the flock too. The fact is, we've been adding to the flock all week. Now, ain't that something to celebrate? You betcha. That's Indeed. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, it sure is. It sure is. And. We've got a celebration ready to go. Are y'all kids out there ready to celebrate? Yeah! 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 Yeah!